We can measure the optical activity of caro syrup using a laser and two polarizers. We first adjust the second polarizer until no light gets through to the screen. When the neck of the bottle is inserted, the light is rotated as it passes through the syrup and so some of it gets through the second polarizer to the screen. We then again adjust the second polarizer until no light gets through. This shows that the light is still linearly polarized, although it's rotated as it passes through the caro syrup. When the light passes through 2.5 centimeters of caro syrup, it's rotated through an angle of minus 30 degrees. And when it travels through 6 centimeters of syrup, it is rotated through an angle of minus 76 degrees. And when the light passes through 9.5 centimeters of syrup, it's rotated through an angle of minus 118 degrees. In fact, the angle of rotation is proportional to the distance of syrup through which the light travels. Different wavelengths rotate polarization by different rates, as can be seen by placing the bottle between these two polarized sheets.